my god, Laz. Laz! Yes, yes, I hear. You hear? <laughs> Where, is here. Here. Where is here? Where is here? Here is here. Here ah, is here. Here is here. <laughs> here, is here. Yeah. And here happens to be Mech Warrior 5 mercenaries. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so ah. let's, let's get over with the ham. Um, just a quick little disclaimer for the people watching this in the future. Uh, the way we are doing this, specifically this is information for my lads, since they're the ones going to get pings on Discord about it. Uh, oh, yeah. Going to be uploading 30 minute to an hour long sessions every Wednesday of whatever game Laws and I, or whoever and I choose to move on with. But right now, Laws and I are starting with MechWarrior yes, 5 Mercenaries. Yes, we need a dead body. And, Somebody um, after dead. Yeah, right? Yes, let's see here. Uh, skip tutorial and let this play out. In yes! Way, humanity began colonizing the stars. Their reach would eventually span a vast region of space known as the Inner Sphere. During its golden age, under the governance of the Star League, the Inner Sphere experienced unprecedented peace prosperity, and technological advancement. But with a great rise comes a great fall. Beset by greed and mistrust, humanity splintered. The Star League crumpled. Technological advancement slowed. The great houses, each vying for supremacy, turned on one another, engaging in a series of conflicts known as the Succession Wars. Amidst this chaos, Mercenaries became the proxy forces for the Great Houses. Numerous battlefields sprung up across the Inner Sphere, dominated by hulking war machines known as Battle Max. The year is now 3015, and these steel behemoths have become the tools of the mercenaries' trade. It's a lucrative time, yet one beset with perils of all kinds. Only the most skilled and brave among them will rise to become legend. <laughs> I have a feeling we're going to be hearing that fucking guitar riff a lot. I love that song, by the way. <laughs> it's really hardcore, you know? I love it. Oh, so, like, war. It's fucking great, but we're gonna be like bow, now, 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 now. <laughs> <laughs> every like 20 minutes. <laughs> yes, yes. The salvage crates at the last checkpoint were empty. I actually look for the, you know, the music engineer what crate that fucking song. Yeah. Looks like someone is gonna need a lesson in paying their bills on time. That's odd. Well, this is pretty obnoxious. It's possible they left the cash at the last checkpoint in the city. Let's get the money and run, Commander. This is reckless. We need to get back to base. They're distracted with the invasion. We'll be in and out before they know we're here. Let's hope it's not us they're after. Mason, what's your status? I'm fine, Commander. Left arm is offline is all. That was close.
Return to base now. I am not leaving you behind. We were set up, and you're in no shape to fight. Meet me at the extraction point with the Leopard. Go! Now, Captain! Damn it. On the move. Commander, an enemy dropship is approaching your position. Move! Now! I've got eyes on. Identified. Hunchback and King Crab. Damn it! Rihanna, any idea what these guys want? I picked up some chatter about coordinates of some kind. Does that mean anything to you? Coordinates? No, Rihanna. Promise me you won't leave without Jake. Promise me. Commander, I promise. That uh, that whole intro cinematic was very scuffed. <laughs> oh yes, that cinematic was really oh, by the right by the way. You really love when everything just go chill and after everything just explodes in and you run right. through life. Walk at this map, run, dude. <laughs> Sorry to wake you, but our Citrep has changed. Head to the bridge as soon as possible. All right, I've headed to the bridge. It's uh, I don't yes. know why I'm sleeping next door to the bridge, but. Commander. <laughs> we haven't really. Uh, that's a really big shift. We only got one room. Right. Don't this dark is happening in that <laughs> ship. <laughs> his life to save ours. I don't know what's going to happen next, but whatever it is, I'd like to be part of it. I'd like to stay on as your ops commander. That is, if you'll have me. You kidding me? Your family, Rihanna, are as close as I have now. Besides, I'm going to need you. Yes, I suspect you will. About our Citrep, it's not great news. Those bastards that came after us are in the process of setting up a blockade of the system. Which means we're going to be trapped here with a tightening noose around our necks unless we do something about it. Who are these guys? Another mercenary outfit by the looks of it. I don't know more than that at the moment. And these coordinates they were looking for? Not a clue, but we're going to find out. First things first, we need transport out of the system. That means a jump ship. I sent out a transmission right after the attack through the HPG. The message was for a longtime client of your father's and an old friend of mine. 
Name is Spears. He has powerful connections. I'm hoping he can help us out. Until I hear back from him, there's nothing we can do except lay low. In the meantime, Fahad wants to see you down in the hangar. The Centurion needs repairs and he wants to discuss them with you. I'll let you know when I hear back from Spears. Copy that. Down to the hangar we go to speak to Fahad. Oh yes, that's the first starting mission. That's good. Hey mate, figured you'd want an update on the Centurion. Centurion? There, so fair warning, it's gonna be a while before she's operational again. Means you're gonna have to get comfortable with the light mech over It's really over. get mad because you bring the fucking match just with one hand. <laughs> you must be thinking, you just go to a tutorial, what the fuck's happened? Yes, I know what this is all about. Repair. Repair. Okay, go back up to the bridge. <laughs> <laughs> that base is really fucking big for no movement. Right. Just like three or six people in that big ship. Take a listen. Rihanna, I received your message. I'm sorry to hear about Nikolai. He was a good man and an even better pilot. Why does this voice sound familiar? Sorely missed. I assume his son will be taking over the operation. Nikolai was always bragging about the boy's skills. Well, I hope he was right. I've begun working on a plan to get you safe passage out of the system, but it's going to take a little time. I expect you already know by now that whoever attacked you has set up a blockade. This game remember me at Xbox 360 game, yeah, I'm Iron Brigade. Brigade. A tower defense with robots. I want you to proceed to the outermost planet in the system. It's little more than a hunk of ice with a few leftover mining operations on it. There's an abandoned power station there. Now I've got it on good authority that local raiders are using it as a secret cache for their ill-gotten goods. I know you can use supplies and materials for your repairs. I expect you'll find what you need at that location. I've attached the exact coordinates to this message. Once I have a proper plan in place, I'll contact you again. For now, be safe. All right, time to suit up, Commander. I've already input the coordinates. All I need is for you to sign off and get us there. Understood. Okay. Salvage rights. We want better salvage rights. La 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 <laughs> It's gonna take me a few right. missions, Laws. <laughs> yes, it, I think like two missions first. The story of Malayan missions. Attention. Prepare for battle mech departure. Prepare for battle mech departure. Mm, yes, quiet. <laughs> I like how when you look at it, you can tell that the floors were on open in case they need to fucking dump us out of the bay rather than let us walking out. Oh, I hope to see this fucking bay is never in fire. Why? It's a lot of space. When did I go? Th why did I go third person? I'm sure you wish the Centurion was repaired and ready to go. For this particular mission, though, the Javelin is the mech best suited for the job. And hey, it has jump jets. They could come in handy. It has jump jets. But I'd still rather have the Centurion. Well, can't blame the girl for trying. Really, why is my... Ugh, oh, that's disgusting. My triggers what? are on the alternate sides for their... So my right trigger fires my left side lasers and my left Oh, trigger... yes. What? The... You have to... Yes, yes. I see that first, the first time. I see, like, the bullets from my right hand coming for the left, and the left coming for the right. I think you must touch the configuration and um, fix it. I mean, I know how to fix it. I 
these raiders are his derelicts, Commander. But you can bet his perimeter defenses won't be. My guess, the raiders will have... Okay. Square is breaking. If that's the case, it that's means punch. Have a generator <laughs> close by. I love, I love punch. Punch the is my favorite The almighty punch. Button. The yeah, almighty yeah. punch. I hope to find someday a repair bake gun or beacon I'm in or something here because this fucking game will be really when I need some kind of medic. <laughs> right, it would be pretty funny so, if there was a repair vehicle, but I don't think there's a. No, no, I don't think we're gonna be find that shit here. Nope, not in this kind of a game. No, you're dead or you're alive. No medics. Pretty much. How do I lock onto targets? There we go, triangle. Triangle, triangle, uh huh? This is like playing MechWarrior Online again. I fucking love that. Oh, yes, like a lot of games before this. I must think people will find some games and play before they do this fucking game. It's so easy to play. Ah. Uh, I should, uh, on my PC, try and get my Steel Battalion controller working for this. Oh, um, I think it should be fine. What's gonna suck, Laws, is once we get co-op, you're gonna have to play with a light mech for a little bit because it's gonna take a little bit to get another medium mech. Uh, it's okay, that's fine. That's no problem for me. Oh, uh, I just had a tank, like, fall over. <laughs> oh. and I guess I just stepped on it. <laughs> you got a fucking match. You have to try to escape itself. It's scary. Right. Um, can I move? Thank you again. I appreciate you. Appreciate you greatly. God, I'm, I'm like, I'm gonna confuse myself because the controls are like completely different to that on the Steam Deck, which is weird. Yo, we're gonna take a time and fix your controls first. Oh. Maybe I'll fix it later. Or I might just All ignore right. it and... Can you shoot the gun? Thank you. There we go. It'd be really nice if MechWarrior Online came to console. We could have a versus. Oof. That would be fucking uh, fantastic, by the way. That would be too hard, more hardcore. <laughs> In this fucking mind just exploding and destroying, my god. It's okay, everything's supposed to explode when you shoot it. 
Yes. He's got good graphic, by the way. Yeah, it's fucking great. I love it. I have a lot of fun with this game. No, the game is fucking look good. <coughs> Sorry. Where am there I am. Excuse you. Could you kindly fucking not? I love punching <laughs> tanks. I wish more games let me punch tanks to death. If you get a fucking match, you should fucking just whack on it and punch it. Right? Come here, little tank. Here, my zip zap guns want to kill you. There we go. See, wasn't so hard now, was it? Oh, I love that we can just walk through buildings. It's fucking great. Ah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's. Tarek uses punch on tank. It was highly effective. That's why we give, give you a trophy. <laughs> right? Finally, you punch a tank! I always wanted to punch a tank. I'm probably gonna lose a limb here just by being a fucking idiot. There we go. Got the punch. Do, 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 do. Alright. First real mission done. Alright. Now I just... fix up my... <sighs> just need it to finish a couple more missions and then I can get co op running. I think it's like the third mission. Yeah, my mind is saying third mission. Yes, yes. We got this third mission like tutorials. We need to fight we are final we are first boss. Um, we yeah. can start in the... Yeah... Revel up! Hey, boss man. That was quite the haul you brought back. Gonna make the repairs a bit easier now. But don't go getting stars in your eyes or nothing. I'm overworked as it is, and this ship needs a lot of loving, eh? So your Centurion is still gonna take plenty of time to fix. But yeah, like I said, nice job out there. Your old man will be proud. Now if there's nothing else, gonna get back at it. All right, not a work to do. Story <laughs> of my life. Go to the bridge now. Good work with those raiders, Commander. While you were planet-side, 
I got word from Spears about the plan he's put in place for us. Take a listen. Rihanna, Commander. Good news. I think I can get you safely past the blockade with the aid of a local mining company. To make everything work, I'm gonna have to find you guys a recycled mercenary identification number. A new identity, essentially. Nick's Cavaliers, for all intents and purposes, no longer exists. I'll match that number to a new name of your choosing once the time comes. So, think about what you want to call yourselves. While I arrange that, you're gonna have to do a little work for the mining company in exchange for their cooperation. If things go well, they've agreed to hire you to transport some precious cargo out of the system aboard an inbound jump ship. Using the new mercenary ID and with a legitimate contract in hand, you should have no problem slipping through the blockade. I've attached the particulars to this message. I'll be in touch once you've completed the mission. Good luck. I already reviewed the information Spears sent. The mission is a straight-up protect and defend op. Seems these raiders have been harassing the mining company, among others. Stealing from them, extorting them, killing innocent civilians when their demands weren't met. Mm. I've uploaded the pertinent details into the mission. Oh, finally I meet the option to left the fucking cockpit cam. Another drone cam. I love the first person, not the third person. I prefer first person. See, I'm here. I find the option to make the cam start in first person. View mod. Commander, it'll compromise your visibility. Starting the second mission. Then we get. I think it's the. I think it's the this mission or the third you're getting for a cop. I think it might be this one because this one is the one where we get the lieutenant that or whoever the guy is that's piloting the mech on the ground, right? Ah uh, yes, uh, yes. I think it's that no, one. That was that's the... There were trees on that one. No, I think I'm thinking of the. I think I got one more mission to do after this. Okay, Why does it always go into third person? I don't like. Oh, jo join, go in, go to the option, and general, and you will find it in settings to fix the cam view mode side. Like the. Uh... Really close to the start. Oh, yeah. About these raiders' overall strength or sheer numbers. So keep a short lookout for enemy units on your approach. So that's yeah, I got one more mission to do after this before I'm allowed to start hiring people because the next mission after this is the one where we defend a forest base. Yes. And that has the mercenary or the the dude we recruit off the planet from that one. Funny, I don't feel like I'm going 90 kph. <laughs> I will send you a picture with the option. I've already done it, I've already changed it. Oh, oh okay, 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 okay. It's never mind, it's go by the way, but never mind. Oh, I just ran over a fucking guard tower. The first time I played that mission, I destroyed the whole of the base. Just yeah. running and jumping. <laughs> that's good, that's a tutorial. You know, you can destroy your fucking ally co uh, building. Oh, you stop that. And you get punched out of fucking existence. There we go. Okay, I gotta turn this fucking... The sensitivity... Or not the sensitivity, the aim assist off. Having aim assist is fucking dumb. <laughs> I, I moved that shit for the first time. Well, like, with it on high, it pretty much, it's almost impossible to miss your target. I'd nah, but no reason for playing so. I want to shoot in the fucking leg, not in the chest. Right, it just automatically targets the fucking center of mass on a...
I punch! Yeah. Tank versus you know this fist. Race? Fist wins. <laughs> For what reason a big fist more bigger than the tank is can win? Oh my god. Yes, I know there's a guy behind me. I should probably kill him. Fuck off, tank. Yes, the settlement is no longer at the haha -ha funny number. Things are getting out of hand. <laughs> Do destroy more, more of the base of the enemy. <laughs> right. To use the kick, the kick of the power, not the punch Dude, of I the wish, destruction. I wish I could <laughs> kick. It'd be like playing Armored Core, but Mech Warrior. Oh, yes. <laughs> Alright, so now that, this is a, now that this objective is over, I can just run through this base and kill everything in it. I think my mech is a little bit damaged. Its lights are flashing at me. That is like, I think like that is a Sean is Pem Pem Radio. Oh, yeah, I'm being uh being jammed here, boss. Jammed? Uh, yes, I mean jammed. My God, it's Raspberry. Take it, eight. Scorpion light tank. For target. I should really love one a repair mage with one fucking gun in this game. Not anymore. Not anymore. Just send. Larry to kill himself, kill everything and come back, make a repair yourself. Just in time too. That mining facility is getting hit hard, Commander. And punch, 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 punch! Oh, yes, I love punches. I'm pretty sure I will see somebody with a shotgun and using the punch. Hm. I can a, feel the presence. I'm gonna <laughs> punch every mech I can. <laughs> Anytime I get the option to, it's gonna be pounch. You made it! We need your help! <laughs> the 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 crew could name itself the bunch of hammer. <laughs> right. I didn't realize we were saving a bunch of rednecks. <laughs> Save them all the time? Bloody word. Um, excuse me, that was a little embarrassing, I'm sorry. <laughs> you are not the skill soldier. Kill them all. I know, right? What? Kill them with the punch. Yeah, well, unfortunately, my torso is like on fire right now. <laughs> so many punch. Um, I took an SRM 20 to the fucking torso. Ooh. I've almost lost both of my fucking shoulder plates. <laughs> You're fighting with each chest on one hand. <laughs> yeah, I might be fighting with- I might be fighting as a zombie mech. <laughs> Just my fucking legs and fucking- uh, I don't even think I'd have lasers Why? at that point. <laughs> you only got the foot, the torso, and the face. 
I don't know if I can Just cause damage if I lose like my guns. <laughs> because if I lose if I lose my uh, my side torso, then I lose my arms with it. I think. Yes, it's dropped. Your, your arms dropped. For that reason, I tell you, it should be fucking fantastic if somebody could have been like some kind of engineer or medic here. <laughs> And it's so fucking expensive to repair a fucking robot here. My god. I feel like everybody should play sniper in this game. Try to hide yourself. Well, yeah, it's, you're supposed to be playing it like a giant walking tank. I think get the SN9 robot with a shield. And it's, <laughs> and it's just come back with one hand. That's not a good tank. <laughs> oh shit. You know who's gonna really do a lot of damage to the settlement? It's gonna be fucking me. Can I put this fucking medic in reverse? Jesus Christ, what am I stuck on? <laughs> You're something like me. Dude, what the fuck? Something's holding my foot. I can't move. Right? Thankfully you missed, um, but I need you to come a little bit closer, friend. Come on, just a little bit closer. Ow, 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 ow. Here, take some of my rear armor off, would you? There we go. There goes the Igor. The heavy attack chopper. Fuck, I just lost a piece of my torso. This repair, they are so fucking bad. I don't love it. Okay, I need to kill one more hella chopper, I think. Okay, let's recharge the... Well, um, I've lost half of my javelin. <laughs> the second mission, right? Right. Oh, oh. All right. This is a bad signal, uh, extreme signal. It's all good for me. And what's funny is, like, I didn't lose this much... I didn't take this much damage when I played it on my Steam Deck. Well, the first time I did with the first boss, I said, okay, this is look bad, and I love it. The first boss just killed me so easy. Okay. Dude, I actually lost money accepting that mission. <laughs> <laughs> <Come back. laughs> they back. They pay you less when you're losing the robot. The robot coming with one hand, no legs, right? and just the torso. <laughs> Hold on, let's take a look at this thing. Yep, I'm missing my whole left side. <laughs> <laughs> I was in a, a picture of my robot. You <laughs> say, oh my god, Lost. Oh, the f are you arrived, so. <laughs> I need a true zombie mech. One that I can just put all of my stuff through my center torso. Look, all my fucking match arrived to the base when I for I finished the last mission I could finish. <laughs> I said, well, I think next time I know going alone to the battlefield. Well, I mean, if once you've completed the third mission, you should really go out and start recruiting pilots. Yep. My pilot really suck, or me is a sucker, but a really bad player, I mean. Damn, dude, you lost your fucking AC-10. <laughs> <laughs> that is bad, I tell you it's bad. <laughs> you know, you're supposed to like swivel your left arm to intercept shots, so that way... <laughs> the good hand is lost. You're supposed to take off your shield arm, not your fucking gun arm. 
<laughs> I finish just in the face. The almighty face never miss. I mean, you know, like, winning. Right. <laughs> I Laws jump. Cast fist. I jump. I'm just a fist with a fucking helicopter, bro. You know what that mean? I know when I'm dead here. Ah, shit. This is the first <laughs> mission. What's right, going start... on? I'm starting the third yes. one. Ah, yes. I think it's after the third one. The cop starting. Yes. That's when the that's when the fun begins. Yes, I think you have to come out for the enemy space. Oh, what? What the hell is... Well, this isn't the mission I was thinking of. These raiders were taking down our murderers and thieves, Commander. Don't show them any mercy. I think you're going to the offense mission first. Yeah, I gotta go do the raider mission first. Yes, yes. God damn it. You have to go destroy the enemy base, and you come back to the base and... I think the cops start in the air. Uh, I gotta do one more. So I gotta do four missions before I unlock co-op. I wish my jump sh or my drop ship would just fly around and fucking shoot LRMs at people. That should be easy. Maybe I should have just used my javelin for this mission. Are you sure? <laughs> Not really. <laughs> Generally, it looked like a fucking repair ship for the base. Nothing looked like a solid fucking robot. Look at that, it's just got a riding in back. Fuck off, Manticore. Tiny Manticore. I usually play like light medium mechs whenever I play on uh, Mech Warrior Online. I really love the heavies. Slow, powerful, slow shots. Just like the Bulldog. God. I love the fucking recoil from firing my AC-10. It's easy to move control with it. Well, the easy just got some like 50 ammunition or like 100, I think. Laser is unlimited. No, ammunition is not unlimited. Just Since the have... laser. Yeah, the lasers are unlimited. The energy weapons are unlimited. Yes. Bonk. Oh, I missed. That's sad. Here, I won't miss this time. Oh, never mind, I will miss. Excuse me, Mr. Tank. I need you to just fuck off, thanks. Let's never talk about that ever again. Oh, <laughs> put the fist. Put the fist <laughs> in the eye. The fist stacking within. I find it really funny that I can, like, punch a ro another robot with my fucking gun barrel. No, mm, if only I, I could pull the trigger as it impacts. Shotgun and... put shotgun and after punch him in the face. Dude, I would love to have Make a it. fucking shotgun, but I don't know where to get an LBX-10. Oh, that'd be really fucking fantastic. You can use four weapons. Four shotgun is really stupid in close range. Well, you can have a lot more than four weapons, you just have four weapon groups. There's a difference. Yep. So you can be a really fucking battle tank. Fuck off. <laughs> Didn't I say we were gonna be hearing the same fucking riff for a little bit? Uh, yes, actually, yes. Okay. Just making sure I said that. Yep. 
<laughs> I got the re I got the I got the record by the way. <laughs> Time for me just to walk through buildings, dude. I need to get a fucking a warhammer mech. <laughs> um, a hammer on a shotgun. Can I walk through this? No. Well, I punch instead. Thanks. <laughs> um, excuse you, but could you fucking not? Ah, oh, shit. One day I'll be able to hit this guy. There we go. <laughs> One day you will catch him. Right. One day you will feel the true power of the fist, the iron fist. There we go. I was trying to shoot an aircraft down with my auto cannon, which was, you know, taking a long fucking time. <laughs> yes, I know what is it. The laser is more fast. Zone. They are, what we say, more faster than my arm. <laughs> you, can, you can use your fist to kill the aircraft like me. Right. <laughs> I'll punch you, helicopter. Just you wait. Someday you will get catch with the punch of the iron fist. The law, the iron laws. <laughs> All right, this is... Can... What am I stuck on? Back the fuck up. Fuck off. Alright, I think I am about to comp- well, not about to complete, I'm, I gotta go kill the fucking dude at the base now, but I'm getting pretty close to finishing this third mission. Yes, I think it's the- I think it's the first campaign about the first- the, that is the last mission of the first campaign before you come over the space. Need to finish campaign one. Keep to longer ranges? What do you think this is? Give me those legs, spider. Aha, I just shot him in his big toe and he fell over. Oh, you catch him, it's good. No control, you have to drop. One shot, one dead. And I punched his body, which probably made the salvage I'm about to collect here a little bit more damaged. Yes, I think that's the last mission you need. The ice, finish the ice ward and the cop starter. I'm fairly certain the co-op starts after the fourth mission, because yes. that's when we... S this is the third mission, though. Oh, yes. When you start the forest mission, is cop, co I think. Yep, after, after the uh, forest mission, where we uh, yes. recruit the first AI companion, mm -hmm. that should be when it opens up to co-op. To co-op.
Oh, what? I can't get the mech? Oh, that sucks. I wanted that spider. I don't know why, I don't like... I don't use fucking light mechs. From what I hear, light lances aren't really that useful in this game. Yes. I'm gonna start repairing that. Hey there, Gov. Well, hey there, Gov. You've got a name for these bastards you've been chasing us down. Black bloody inferno, eh? Right? Well, that's a lot of bollocks, isn't it? You know isn't what it? a black inferno is? It's bloody smoke, mate. All right then. Nice chat. Gonna get back to work now. <laughs> I don't understand what Fahad's purpose is with like. Oh, why is my my screen keeps going black? What the hell? That was weird. Come oh, here, bog off the game. Thanks to your efforts, the mining company have kept their word and booked us transport on a jump ship. Spears has also obtained a new mercenary ID number. So, all we need to do now is choose a new name for our merc outfits, and we're good to go. I'll leave that up to you. Once you've registered the new name, come back and see me. Will do. Alright, I'm gonna put something edgy as my mercenary name, like the Reapers or something dumb. Oh, yes. And instead of that bad idea, I'm just going to do the obvious thing. Oh, you could put the Dead March. <laughs> okay, Commander. Everything is set for our departure. The transport contract with the mining company is a false flag Spears and I set up with their cooperation. The mining company has legally hired us to transport cargo for them. But in reality, there is no cargo. Just a destination and some very convincing paperwork. So, where are we headed? We've been asked by Spears to help him out of the jam. I think we owe him. I agree. What's he need us to do? Spears works for Interstellar Expeditions. One of the largest archaeological collectives in the Inner Sphere. They do archaeological digs and conduct research into abandoned Star League era facilities in the pursuit of lost technology from before the Succession Wars. One of the expedition's dig sites has come under attack. A rogue mercenary group is intent on pillaging a Star League supply depot that IE uncovered on Brooklyn Prime. We're going in to help protect the site. Spears will provide more detailed information on what exactly we're facing once we arrive. For now, I've uploaded the coordinates. This game is hardcore, my god. Right. You can't believe some time a little time can destroy your fucking wall, wall robot. Alright, taking the first jump ship. Nice. Battle mics. Enemy forces. Oh, miss the enemy forces. Oh my god. Okay. Ah. On the forest planet.
Just ahead of your current position. <laughs> Roger that. Well then, how would you start wor start walking towards me, Mr. Blackjack? Oh, you're gonna walk away from me and get killed, aren't you? <laughs> oh, mate, if I roll fight fist. Friendly faces. Dude, I need to work on my fucking aim. Why am I so bad at aiming all of a sudden? <laughs> like, shotgun, no need aiming, bro. Dude, right? I, I need actually, I got a shotgun. <laughs> I need to get my shotgun. I need yes. To find LBX auto cannon. Ha ha ha!